Hello, awesome professionals. Welcome to VMware Question Based Learning Forum. Here is our question number 12. Which two traffic types can be configured for dedicated VM kernel adapters? Choose two options. And your options are A discovery traffic, B vMotion traffic, C vSphere replication traffic, D vSphere custom traffic. The answer is B vMotion traffic and C vSphere replication traffic. Let's understand the reason why. The reason is VM kernel adapters are specialized virtual adapters used for VM kernel services and also used by the vSphere host to communicate with outside world. So the reason for vMotion traffic is vMotion is one of the most widely used VM kernel service in data center operations. To perform vMotion, the VM kernel adapter needs to configure with vMotion service, else vMotion check itself will fail. The reason for option C is vSphere replication traffic is another widely used VM kernel service. To isolate the incoming replication traffic on target ESXi host, VM kernel adapter needs to configure with vSphere replication service, else management network traffic will be used for replication. So let's review our options again. A discovery traffic and D vSphere custom traffic cannot be the answer because we don't have a dedicated TCPIP stack for custom traffic and there is no such thing called discovery traffic. So A and D cannot be the answer. vMotion traffic and the vSphere replication traffic are the only traffic types which require dedicated kernel adapters. Here goes our question number 13. Where is a virtual SAN fault domain is configured? And your options are VMware vSAN cluster configuration, B VMware HA cluster configuration, C VMware DRS cluster configuration and D data center advanced settings configuration. Now share your answers in comment section or watch out our next video to know the answer. Follow us on at the rate of GoVM lab for more questionnaire based learning. Thank you.